Welcome to this edition of Hoosier Quick Hits. Alongside Josie Janavistas, I'm Carly Murata, and Josie, Indiana fell to Iowa tonight 77-63. They've really been struggling offensively lately. What do you think is the problem? Well, I think the problem for Indiana is once they start missing shots, they're kind of either trying to force something to happen or trying to, you know, make their offense be something different than what it is. You know, if the three-point isn't falling, they're kind of lost or if you know if shots aren't falling they're trying to force things you know against Iowa that's an outstanding rebounding team um, trying to force stuff up the middle is just wasn't the most effective strategy tonight so I think once Indiana kind of settles down and realizes hey like sometimes we should just maybe take the risk and take a shot or maybe you know take take some risk offensively besides their normal rhythm then then maybe something will fall into place. The rebounding, the timely second chance points um, were a difference. It was just about the way we finished in the game. You know, we just had to get back in and look what we had open. We have open instead of taking shots, you know. Just had to get back and work on it. Disappointed in our recognition. And, and um, we had, we, we, there were too many times we're trying to make a play at the rim and we're not getting, we're not getting, we're not getting credit for it. And I think they had eight free throws before we ever went to the foul line, right? Uh, I gotta see our layups through. There's layups and dunks that we missed before, but we just never missed that many before, so we just gotta see it through. We've gotta play the game outside the three point line. That doesn't mean we have to shoot threes all the time, but it does mean that we've gotta get the game moving. And then after the game, there were some strong reactions from the crowd, some strong chants. What are your reactions on that? Well, I think it was kind of uncalled for from the fans. I mean, yes, it was not a great loss to say the least not that any losses are good losses and this one will probably have some impact come seating on selection Sunday but you know the crowd didn't really show up this game the crowd really had no right to be the way they were based on their contribution to the game which I know sounds weird but like Assembly Hall really is a great home court advantage for this team they definitely play better their home record is way better than their away record so really I thought it was uncalled for and this will, this loss will have some impact on seeding I think there's still Indiana still a tournament team but it really will have an impact these last two games do mean a lot to us um, just like this next one coming up we're gonna give it all we got um, and uh, we're just gonna fix the effort we had tonight it's like this it's pretty disappointing when um, you lose by so much at home uh, with the great crowd and great fans like that. But like JB said, we're just going to come back and now we're on to the next game versus Michigan State. Teams are going for their 20th win. They got theirs. We want to go get ours on, on Saturday now. And we have to bounce back in a hurry and um, get ready for a team that's extremely tough, extremely physical. We knew this was this kind of week. Okay, and that does it for our episode of Hoosier Quick Hits. We have an episode on Thursday. Um, as for Josie Janovicius, I'm Carly Murata. Thanks for watching.